Shalom, friends. Just a quick word of encouragement as we continue through our day today. You know, for a number of years during our worship service here at Messiah, I would encourage people as we transitioned from song to study to greet one another and say to each other, you matter. Now, I didn't come up with that on my own. Actually, I discovered it in the Word of God. There's a beautiful teaching that comes to us that helps us to remedy the feeling that our life might not be as significant or as important as those around us. And sometimes we can really feel that our lives do not matter as much as others. But the Lord gives us this beautiful lesson if we allow it into our neshama, into our soul. In this week's portion of Bamidbar, meaning in the wilderness, we read this from Numbers chapter 1 and verse 2. Se'u et rosh ko edot b'nei Yisrael. Literally, this is saying, lift up the heads of the children of Israel. And what the Lord is telling Moses is this, go to each person and lift up and look them right in the face so that they know that they matter before me. In most translations, this is rendered, take a census of the children of Israel. But what the Lord is commanding is much more intimate, much more personal, and much more impactful in our life if we receive it. Now, although Numbers does give us a, a total of the census that is taken, there is another assemblage of the, of the children of God, of the people of God, that does not give us a number. And there's a reason for that. In Revelation chapter 7, verse 9, we see a complete picture of the redeemed family of God standing before the throne and before the Lamb. John tells us that the number could not be counted of those who were there. And why would that be so? Heaven forbid we believe that there is not enough room for us in heaven, that there's too many there, that they've run out of space, or whatever other message that we might tell ourselves that we're not quite as important as those who are counted. And there are some Christian denominations that take an accounting and leave many of their people in a very desperate way. But that's not the message that the Lord is giving us. He is saying, you matter so much to me that I don't want you to feel excluded. I want you to know that there is space in my home, in my house, that Messiah did prepare a place for you before me. Why? Because you matter. And I pray that you know you matter. Amen. Amen.